CrossFit internet. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, hello, everybody. It's Nikki and Eileen here coming at you today with a, uh, a recycling, upcycling of a um, crisp tube. We won't mention names, but hey, there they go. <laughs> we'll try crisp not to show you, but it's um, kind of uh, hard. Yeah. <laughs> Tubes. Yeah. Throw my phone somewhere. Where? If it rings, I'm going to be angsty lemma. Oh yeah. But you know, it'll be my husband if it rings. And I must have known because I'd uh, gone to the supermarket and picked up a um Stanley, oh, good. Stanley you know, a little yeah. rising yeah. thing anyway. So must have known. Oh, it's got a safety catch. Nice. Yeah, it does. Does. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Must be a new model or something because I haven't had a safety catch on mine before. Oh, really? I think all mine yeah. have a safety catch. Ah, first time for me. <laughs> first time for everything. Yeah. Okay, let's see here. I was. Oh. I think I'm going to have to use card cardboard. Um, yeah. Wow. Okay. I've got these uh, these leftover foam sheets, but I'm looking at it, and they're pretty inflexible. So, mm. <laughs> so I'm maybe thinking, um, I'm thinking like old chip, like the thin chipboard cardboard. Yeah. So like yeah. boxes. So I'm gonna go look. I didn't even pull anything out. I'm terrible. Yeah. So I'll probably make this the base because it's inflexible. So um so that makes it not very good. So I'll have to just quickly whiz and look for something else, won't I? But base, it's good for a base. It's all about the base. I think I'll just need like kind of the and the cutter is behind somewhere. Yep. It's all planned out, right? <laughs> right. Exactly. Uh, well, at least we're getting half. We're getting partly there, Nikki. We're actually having a plan with you. We just didn't plan what pre-cut and all that stuff ahead of time because that would have made too much sense. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I, I thought about it. And I thought, now I've got plenty of time tomorrow. Yeah. And, uh, and then they phoned me up about 50 minutes ago to ask me to go to another client. So I don't have that time I thought I had. Okay, I'm going to, is this going to be too much of an angle? So I have a problem with my camera, Nikki. Oh, no, again. I can't zoom. I don't know how to get it onto my, like, you know how I have my other webcam and I can go on to, like, tools? On this yeah. one, I can't get it up onto my to open it up for tools. I can't do that. And um, oh man, I cut myself somewhere. Where? Maybe doing dishes. Ouch! I just noticed it's like stinging. Um. So I'm having that kind of trouble where I can't uh, zoom. So I gotta get my camera closer. I don't know how to work my angles because. When I record, all I can all I can do is touch the thing and go uh, focus. <laughs> so I've been recording on my um, video maker thing that I bought, and yeah, I didn't realize I cut myself. So that's uh thing I'm like I was playing my computer yesterday trying to figure it out can't figure it out weird I had to download things so I can have the camera working that's right yeah when I did that there's no like where as my other camera webcam says you can click on webcam and then you can record off of there and save it right. it's weird. I don't know tried putting the name in and all that stuff and just nothing I don't know okay I'm at lost with that one 
Yeah, I'm not, sure too. How, yeah, I'm not sure how big to make this. So all my videos are quite distance away, unless Nikki's filming and she can make it go up. <laughs> yeah, I can. I can only. I can, I've only got two things on this, which is that one and that one. Yeah. So, so I'm zoomed in as much as I can. On it. Yeah. Yes, we should want to start off further out. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to eyeball some strips because I am not measuring. I moved my camera down because it was so far away up there. And then you can see all my table, <laughs> which you don't really see. And it was just harder for people to see everything. I'm working on these videos, and I don't think people are just like seeing anything, or at least not the things that. Oh, man, this is thick. They should be seeing, like the details. Guess I'm gonna have to try a few things out, figure it out. Which is the best angle to record again. Some of these will be. I'm just cutting a bunch of strips. Some of these will break apart because. Loved your last little video there, Nikki. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I don't know if I got a chance to comment or not. I can't remember now. That little hop. Yeah. yeah. That was cute. Yeah. I've got to figure out how to put the music back on. It's been a while. <laughs> yeah. It's a little bit um having to talk for that amount of time about <laughs> what you're doing, you know me. I'm not used to doing that. Yeah. <clears throat> it sounded really good, so I'm obviously cutting way too many of these and just getting it all done and then, then I don't have to cut more after if I was short. Wow, that's a loud, sorry, for your ears. Because there's a little piece that's folded in there. That's, yeah, there's a little folded cardboard. Scared it. Yeah, I see, that didn't sound too good. Ping, ping, ping. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Now, my camera probably did move from how it was. Obviously, it would because just that's just the way life goes. We don't want to make anything come apart. Sorry, I'm moving my camera a bit. 
Okay, perfect ish. These are quite thick, but I think they will do. Glue. I'm behind here. I'm behind. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. The last time I put this against myself, I got glue on me, and I'm not getting glue on my sweater. <laughs> new, new, new. Okay. Or was it my jammies or something? I can't remember what it was last time, but this time I don't want to get my sweater. Hi, dude. Is that you? Daddy? Dude? Yeah? Yeah. Here's a little, um, sorry, I'm moving the camera. I can do that with this one. Oh, yeah. Watch them. Sorry about the mess. Oh, maybe I can't, I can't, it's getting caught up. I was scared when you do that, just in case I see a snake or a spider or something. I don't think you, well, maybe you will see, never mind, maybe I shouldn't do that then. Do, <laughs> not your snake. It's not your snake, is it? <laughs> Well, the snake is in the container behind her, but you might be able to see a little pattern of it. Never mind then. But no, 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 no. I, was the joking, cute. I was joking about the snakes. It's a spider that gets me. <laughs> Look at her. Isn't she cute? <laughs> yeah. Don't. <laughs> Sorry. I had to finish. Yeah, yeah. She's looking so cute in front of the heater. Oh. They always go in front of the little um, heater by our sink in the kitchen. They have the heater uh, on the board, like on the side, not on the floor. Yeah. And um, now I messed up my camera. And all the chihuahuas just sit there and they shiver and they're so cute. <laughs> right? All right. Anyway. Darn cute. That's all I have to say. This is excellent. This one. Mm -hmm. Every time I uh, try to put pressure on it, it cuts it down. Yeah, you have to pull that thing out. Yeah, all the way, is it? Yeah. Uh, newfangled thing. It's called safety. <laughs> yeah. It's all dangerous because you don't know how to operate it. Hi. Uh, hi, Amory. Hi, hi, Julie. Hi, uh, Julie. Julia. Julie, Julie. We have a couple safety. of safety. Yeah. Safety, I'm Marie. I don't want to cut myself. <laughs> oh, here. Is this, this going to work? Come on. Okay. Did I move my camera that bad that I can't find my placement now again? Yeah. I feel like I'm working to the side, like I'm stretching. On my spot. Okay. What's going on here? Now I'm filming the floor. This thing is moving. Darn it. Come on. Give me a break. Ah. Why? Uh, 
goodness gracious. Let's see. I'm just That's tying this back up. Back up. Nikki, can you go on yourself for a minute? Because I'm going to okay. get someone seasick here. Yeah, okay. Because uh, I have to tie this thing back up. Fell off. Thank you. Yeah. I'm not sure what's going on here, but it got loose. My little rubber twist tie thing. Oh, dude, you too cute. <laughs> okay. Okay, I think I'm good. Thank you. It was just really annoying because it was. Uh, yeah, it was slowly moving down to the floor under my table, kind of a thing. Yeah. Well, it's either going to be a um, it's either going to be a hot mess, summary or it's going to be um, some towers or furry house or something. Yeah, it's a uh, <laughs> so one or the other. <laughs> so far, I'm feeling like it's a hot mess for me, but okay. yeah, I wonder if I can get a stapler through this. Stapler. Yeah, this is really hard. Oh. I got a bunch of staplers here, but this one's mine that I use all the time. So I'll use my. I just got um some ones giving away staplers. It's just holding this. It's driving me nuts, right? Okay, there we go. Cheat, cheat. Okay. It was driving me cray cray. You know. Oh my goodness. Okay. Now my dog, well, Chloe's dog being in whiny pants. I won't, I'm going to order one of those long staplers. Yeah. Yeah, so then I can make like little booklets when I want to. But that would be handy for something like this, too, because then I can staple all the way down. <laughs> so, yeah, they're about, um, oh, come on. They're pretty reasonably priced on Amazon. I just need okay. some money. The money. Money, 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 money. Yeah. <laughs> The morning. Oh. oh, I know what I was going to do. I was looking on um, Pinterest just before you uh, got on. Because I'm trying to get some ideas for crafts for the kids. Uh -huh. And I saw this. Um, I was thinking about doing that. When I was a kid in school, we did that nail art where we did the twine, twine around. I was looking at that. But... When they have the kits, they want so much money for them. And when I was a kid, they had the, like the pre holes that you put the nails in and all that kind of stuff. When I was a kid, they just had the pattern on the paper. What's going on with my phone these days? And then um, you're still organizing stuff out, like your craft stuff, Anne. Um, what was I saying? But yeah, we just had the dots where to hammer it and we put the paper on the board. And the ones I've seen, like they have the little pre, like little pre holes in the board to drill it, or like partially, you know, so to you can hammer it in. Oh, I should understand though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what's the difference, but to me, it's just like, yeah, is that what you're paying like thirty five dollars for for wow. one little thing? Like, you know, the nails are not that expensive. Like, do you know what I mean? Yes, yeah. Easy. Oh. You have to make your own. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. I have to make my own design. Especially if I got, like, say, a bunch of kids and I'm not, like, I'm not charging them at the library for crafts. Oh, my gosh. This is the last one I'll be able to staple. I have to come up with another idea. I'm going to staple this one. Oh yeah, that's the last one. I need to get the long staple. 
Anyway, to me, that's a ripoff. They always have these kits that are just so expensive. At Walmart and, and wherever. But I suppose people who are not as crafty would look at it and be like, oh, wow, right? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'm just, uh, what's that word? Biased or whatever. Okay. How am I going to do this one? Maybe I could cut out the bottom, pop off the bottom so I can staple this side. <laughs> can I do that? Do what you want. <laughs> Something's going on with my phone. It's really acting weird. Got a new provider, and I'm wondering if that's it, where it's just weird. Also, too, tacky glue would be really helpful right now. This is just PVA, but the tacky glue is a bit tackier. Right? Like, yeah, hence the name. <laughs> yeah. And I haven't had any of that for ages. I haven't bought anything like that for ages. Yeah, this is just the cheapest Walmart kids craft glue that I'm using right now in this jar. Not my usual craft glue PVA. This is the cheapy, but. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Amory said, you got, haven't you got double-sided tape? Oh my gosh, Emery, you're a genius. What the heck am I doing here? <laughs> Thank you. Put you away. <laughs> what have I been doing here? Now, where did I put that? Where did I put that? Where did I put that? Right here. My gosh. <laughs> And that's why it's good to have people watching. <laughs> My goodness gracious, I cannot believe myself. Thank you. the brain of this operation? Oh, oh see, I'm Marie. <laughs> yeah, Marie. <laughs> Not me. Uh. Okay, bone folder, where are you? Blah, 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 blah. Are you right? Are you right? faster gosh darn it <laughs> yeah just keeping everyone on their toes mm. oh my goodness gracious stapling it even oh <sighs> There we go. <laughs> Thanks, Anne Marie. Why is my is that what's going on? Update available, is it? <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, I'm just gonna plug in my computer before I forget that, but um. no, I don't know what that is. It's a really weird sound. Nothing popped up that I can see. Uh, might be me, who knows? <laughs> Maybe. Okay. <laughs> My goodness. 
can't get over that, can you? <laughs> no, I can't. That's just crazy. I don't know what else. Uh, baby pups. <sighs> Thank goodness for Anne-Marie, because I'd be here still waiting for things to right. <laughs> Or oh, trying yeah. to take my tube apart to try to staple the other end. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I know, right? All right. The silliest thing that I couldn't even think of. The easiest thing. There we go. <sighs> now. My phone is mm -hmm. Why is my phone being weird? Really Some reading program. Already, okay. Sorry, maybe that was a text from work and I didn't know it. And they because I have a new provider, maybe it makes a new noise. Same phone, though. So I don't know. No, because this was since Saturday. What? No, whatever. I don't know. Okay, I will. Yeah, I don't know either. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, guys. I'll have to look at that after. Okay. So glad that Emery thought about this because this would have took forever to dry these pieces too. Oh, they have to wrap around. Oh, cut stinging, even though know, it's. Not bleeding or anything. I'm whining today. Oh, I am uh, um, I'm dancing with pitbulls. Um, I'm thinking of her name. It's not coming to me at the second. It's coming back to me now. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hello. Um, Rebecca. Yeah, that's what I had to think. My brain went. See, maybe it's just my brain slow today. <laughs> uh, uh, my brain is slow today. Let's just say that it's only today that my brain is slow. Right? <laughs> okay i don't have a brain today still too early you know for it to kick in <laughs> yeah 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 i remembered now rebecca i was like uh, uh i i i know i see you on, online and stuff it's just that my brain is just not computing today it's just like um <laughs> Yeah, yours too, whatever. <laughs> You're the one that outsmarted me here this morning. I'm like, forgot. <laughs> she knows what I have. She's like, don't you have it? <laughs> oh, more than I do. More organized than I am. <sighs> I have my little project done and i can't even finish my video because i don't have triple a batteries to show you guys with the lights on isn't that silly do you want to see it yep my little kit and i don't think the video is going to be good because it was from above and i tried to lean everything over as i'm making i don't have all this stuff um, 
but that's it. And I'm only putting the one light. I didn't like the look of the chandelier, but then I found, I think I might make another, if I do another chandelier, it'll be a cloud chandelier, not the silly one they provide with, because it looks too black okay. and bulky. Let me just uh, go so low on you. Yeah. So that's, oops, that's it. But I have no batteries to light it up to show you guys. But it was a kit, so it was super cute. I did make a pattern of everything that I built. Um, just so then I can be, uh, thanks, steal the pattern. <laughs> so I have a pattern for everything and then I can make everybody, you know, people stuff and share it or whatever. But that's it. I didn't glue my furniture down. Made everything. My little battery is supposed to go in there. I changed the windows and all that stuff because they had these lace for the windows and i didn't like them so i put um that paper what's that paper called that what is that cardstock paper that's like see-through vellum on there and made it kind of like more modern drapey things or whatever and yes everything's falling down but that's that so it's done I changed things a little bit around in there, but that's how I left it. So I gotta make a video, my finishing video. There's my husband calling. And it was a nice thing about the <laughs> What is going on? This phone is really, I'm trying to decline the call and it's not declining. Weird. Anyway, that's it. So you can go back. I just want to show you, but I can't. Yeah, yeah Ellen, I can't um, finish the video with the light on, so I just got that little clip to do and then edit. But I didn't have batteries. Gotta go buy batteries. Ah. And now I just uh, wrecking that thing. Anyway. Oh, there she's calling the house phone. Are you serious? <laughs> man, that man. He knows. He doesn't know anything about my life. Oh, that's frustrating. <laughs> I can see the phone now. <laughs> I'm very upset. <laughs> Ah. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> entertaining. We're keeping it entertaining. I knew he was going to call. We knew he was going to call as well. Yeah. I mean, he calls every day. And he calls me when I'm at work. And I'm like, I am at work. And he never remembers my schedule. And and then he's like, starts talking. And I'm like, I am at work. <laughs> Or you can all ignore it if I'm really busy, like if I can't pick it up. And then he calls and calls. I just, yeah, start putting it on uh, the vibrate. Anyway. I'm actually throwing my strips in the garbage, which is really funny. Funny for me. I'm trying to keep it almost clean in here. So I have half. I have a little bit of room left to tie up. I keep having. In, I'm. I'm in constant tidy mode because I still don't have everything quite settled, and I'm changing things. So in my room. Cooking mushrooms today. <laughs> oh, oh, he says, Kay, just somebody called me and said you're kidnapped and demanded money. No way. He's just kidding, obviously. He can't be oh, doing that. Yeah, no way. 
No way. <laughs> right. How much? Ask him how much you're worth. Yeah. <laughs> how much? Here it is, right here. This is what he said. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Now, <laughs> oh, the man, the man, the man. You're not a fan of mushrooms, they eat them, right? Just to eat. The oh, yeah, I've seen your mushroom thing. It's so cool. Mushroom farm. <laughs> so cool. Rebecca, say, Rebecca says she'll, uh, she'll pay the ransom. I love ransom. She'll pay the ransom. Aw. Well, I don't know if my husband deserves. Who gets the money for the ransom, though? Whoever kidnapped me. Oh, okay. Never mind. I was going to say. Wait a minute. But, yeah. Or... Just kidnap me. <laughs> Just kidnap me. Save me from all of this. Yeah. <sighs> oh, so have you got somewhere dark and dank to um, grow your mushrooms, Rebecca? They grew super fast in six days. Nice. But oh, the thing is, is like, does it grow where you got to eat them all up? Because how I eat mushrooms, I eat like a handful at a time. Like when when I cook them and stuff, I grab like four, one, two, depending on what it is, you know, like I don't yeah. eat a whole lot. So do you have to, yeah. are they growing like kind of like, I see that there's some of them are small, but they're kind of all like not small. They're kind of all like steady size, right? Store them in a paper bag, yeah. I suppose you could dry them out too because I mean, you can rehydrate them. I've had dried mushrooms, yeah. Throw them in. What am I doing? Somehow. Yeah, yeah what are you doing? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I'm not a fan of mushrooms. It's the same for the same reason I'm not a fan of um, cooked spinach. I'll eat spinach raw. Don't like it cooked because it goes slimy. Mm. I just love mushrooms. I've been wanting to do a mushroom farm forever. And it was really nice actually that Rebecca's doing it because that was like so cool to see. But I just oh I gotta let the cat have out. It. I think you could do it on your own. And um, just grab some from this, the store and just blend them in water. And I think if this is true, I have to try it and do it yourself. But I don't know if it's 100% true or not. And then I don't know what you'd put them on. Grow them on something. I can't remember what it was. Oh, carrots, yeah. I like them partially cooked and because I like that carrot, that raw carrot taste that's different than the, the cooked carrot taste. Yeah. So I don't mind them cooked, but they have to be where they still have that taste. So I like that carrot taste. Cooked tar carrots when they're overcooked are awful. Oh, that's what I'm doing. I'm pulling stuff off of my finger with my finger. Tree branches. Oh, good. Man. What am I doing? Hmm, I don't know. Yeah, what are you doing? I'm trying to make a pattern here, but I don't think I did a good pattern. Oh. Yes. Yes. How much time do you have? When do you have to go? Yeah. 
got another hour and a quarter. Mm. No, I was asking Chloe. All right, okay. <laughs> but no worries, yeah. Babysitting, babysitting is she? Childcare. Six to nine months. Wow. But it's worth it, I guess. Ooh. I guess I have to get my gardening stuff ready too because March is coming around the corner and start planting my seeds. I'm sounding so enthused, don't I? <laughs> It's a pain, well, but only because of space. You got to make sure they get sun, and then they're warm enough. The seedlings, and I know I don't buy a, a mat. Like my friend that does her greenhouse, which she's got the gorgeous greenhouse, buys a heating mat for them and all that jazz. And uh, see, I am. I'm stealing the tape that's on there because I'm terrible at this. And I contemplated buying a mat, but. I'm cheapy, cheapy, cheapy person, so. I don't really want to pay for it and then also pay for the electricity because I also use grow lights for my plants. So then I have to uh, pay for more electricity. So I just try to keep them warm by the window. And yeah, see, that's what I'm doing. I'm stealing the blue off of here. I'm not having a good... So I try to keep them warm by the window in March. It's a little, well, not too close to the window, but, oh, I don't know. The heater's there, so. You do have a mat. Mm. Well, I have a little rack that I use for my plants, and last year I used it for a lot of my seeds, but I've been having my plants in there because I'm on it. So I either I have to go buy another metal rack. I don't know. Um, I think the thing that I need to do is just suck it up, buy a grow tent, and do the lights in there and just suck up. And the lights will heat up a little bit. Oh, I did the wrong side. I think. I don't know how much heat you need in there. Oh, that's nice. Well... I'm planning on a huge garden this year in our yard. I'm tired of going somewhere else to, to, uh, I, it's not that I'm overly busy, but I feel like I'm overly busy. I'm always running around to go do something with the girls or to go weed or water the garden. And in the summertime, it just seems like I'm away from the house more. And I like, that's why I'm going to do a garden in the front, a little salad garden in the front. And I think about maybe 12 by 12 garden, but it's going to be pretty big, but not too, too big, you know, like on one side of my front yard. And it'll be just nice leafy stuff. They'll look pretty anyways, right? And then my backyard, I'll have my veggie, veggie, veggie stuff, like tomatoes and tomatoes needs a lot of sun so i'll have a big garden in the back for my squash and all that and hopefully i can get pickling cucumbers this year growing because mine all died after all the seeds and i grew them and i put them outside and they died it was too hot dry hot a lot of things died last year yeah i'm having trouble with white fly this year because we didn't because we didn't have enough cold. water yeah. It hasn't been very cold or anything over winter and then and then they're just mad they're over everything and yeah you know, destroying everything and i've tried and tried and tried to kill them get rid of them but it's not working yeah <laughs> so, oh, oh. yeah i think 
we had there was some kind of little bugs too but then i think what was getting everything was just that the shortage of water and where i had my garden that this year i know i complained about this and and my the garden guys like you keep complaining about this but my the trees on that side were really sucking the water every time i sand on water like you could see that half my garden here's a row of trees and here's the gardens and mine's like right here and you can see that this half of my garden was just small so because the roots were coming and sucking it up obviously oh apparently they only wanted five thousand dollars wow that's not much <laughs> ask him if he's gonna pay <laughs> We'll see what he says about that. Man, I don't feel I'm not worth much. <laughs> now, do I put some paint on this right now? Probably before I start doing more details on it. Because um, it would have been nice if I'd done um this one's going to be a problem because it's going to I'm going to try to see if I can peel the first layer it would have been nice if I had styrofoam and did it with that and then I could do like a wood or something oh yeah it feels I got it I accidentally put the sticker the two side tape on the wrong side I'm just my goal is to damage all my nails so then they don't grow. I had to sand them all down because my middle fingers were getting really wavy and wonky. So I might cut them down, sand them down, start all over. Don't know what I did. Okay. There we go. Don't know what I did with them. Yeah, he just doesn't know it. Your boyfriend. Okay. Since I didn't do styrofoam, I'm going to try with, um, see if I can get some kind of wood grain out of this. My thumbelina is getting wavy. No, my thumbnails. My God, I can't read. Sorry, guys. Oh, my gosh. My brain is not hooked up. What? How am I reading this? Thumbnails. Yeah, they all look, they look fine, even though I need to redo my nails. But these ones, they were so... On this side, it had like a wave. And then this side was kind of doing a little bit of the same kind of wave, but on this side. And I don't know what I'm doing. So it's because I was coloring and maybe I was sketching too much. They were too long and I was making them. I don't know. I remember like years ago when I had long nails, I think these ones curled a bit because I, the way I used to write or draw like this. And then I think I was shaping them by, as they're growing, by the way I was holding my pen so it could have been that so I have to just kind of <laughs> um, pay attention on how I'm holding my pencil and drawing but although I think I hold this way I don't know I don't know if it would be rubbing I don't know 
I don't know. I'll try to grow them again and see. One time I had this finger, ring finger, grow like a duck bill. I had to cut it down because it just was not, it was looking so funny. It just grew like, whoo, like weird. It's funny how nails can be. And I don't know if I did something to it at that time to make it grow like that. It doesn't grow like that quite, but weird. <laughs> Crap like a duck, guys. <laughs> I was like um, realizing that I wasn't really saying crap like a duck on my videos anymore because it just sounded silly, but I kind of did in the last couple of videos, I think now, because I'm like, I haven't done that in so long. And I do love my ducks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So. So yeah, I'm like, I'm gonna start doing that again. I don't know, it just sounds, I guess it sounded funny for a while there for me. It's like crap like ducks and people are like, well, <laughs> the people who know me know or if they remember why I said it, but. Because it was basically let all the stress roll off your, your back like, the water off a duck's back, right? Stress of life, so craft like a duck. All your stresses roll off your back. Like the water off a duck's back. But, yeah. It is my thing. Yes. My thing. The other day I was wearing my bracelet that some a fan made for one of the giveaway things or something that they sent me. Um, I think I had like uh, make me something duck related or something. And I wore it to work. I mean, I wear it every once in a while. I don't want to wreck it. So I try to be very careful with it but has me my, like all eight ducks on it it's got my duck i can't remember who made it now oh. i know it's been so long it's been quite about six years now or something. <laughs> yeah. and i still have like this other things like the paintings i have um um angela made me the duck that is in his uh it's in it's in my glass thing um the one in his car. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. great, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I know I won't be blowing kisses and telling people to catch it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> catch it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. my legs the other way i think i'm hurting my knee oochie oochie you know when you're getting old when your your knees are aching under the table 
um, that was years ago. I think I made brass ducks and colored it with yellow embossed powder. <gasps> was that you? Made brass duck, colored it with yeah. Wow. Was that you then? Julia? Thank you. I'll go grab it. <sighs> oh, I'm banging the camera. Banging it. Okay, no, 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 no. She's gone. <laughs> She's crafty like a squirrel today. She's gone. <laughs> She's a better duck. I had quite a few things made, hanging things and stuff, and I kept all of them. Okay, Lovely. so this is my special jewelry box. It's a dusty. Don't don't mind that. It's very dusty. Oh, now I'm embarrassed. Grab it. I should have wiped it down. All right. See my special jewelry box with my special things. And this is that and this as well. Isn't that cute? Oh, sweet. And yeah, these are my special jewelries. I don't have very much jewelry. This I made out of that paper. Um, remember when we did layer papers and all that kind of art stuff? Yep. Yeah, that's what I made that. I added brass to it, and I have a ring that goes with it for my thumb. Yep, cute. Someone made me this, and I can't remember who. Sorry. It might have been with this. I can't remember. And a few other might. This is another thing I made. These are my special jewelry. For sure. Yeah. There you go. My thumb ring. Anyway, that's them. Sorry about the mess of my ducky thing. Wow, he's dusty. <laughs> yes, what's wrong? I can't braid your hair. I'm streaming. Can you put this in my washroom? My bathroom. Please. Thank you. Sorry. Anyways, showing that off. I got compliments at work, so I was just like, oh yeah, someone made this for me. From YouTube. Anyway. <laughs> and I have, like I said, quite a few cards with docs on them and paintings and a hanging um, string with ducks with kind of spots on them. So cute. That's lots of things. I will remember that now, Julia. Julie. Is it Julie? Julia, I'm sorry if I say it wrong. I, I, in my brain, sometimes I say I will remember now who, who, who gave it to me. It's just that it's been a long time since I opened it. so, And I probably didn't keep the, the envelopes. Or maybe I did. You know me. <laughs> yeah, maybe you did. Yeah, I do have a box of envelopes that I did want to try to make a junk journal of from one of those. From one of those, I did manage to throw the ones away from previous years, Nikki. <laughs> Julie, thank you, Julie. Sorry, or thank you, uh, Emery. I know I keep saying Julie. Sometimes in my head I say Julia, or but. Yeah, I was going to say it's difficult for me. I've got a new yeah. school. It's just like everyone really calls Anne-Marie Annie, and in my head, I I mean, it's Anne-Marie, right? And sometimes when I say Annie, I feel weird saying it, because I've always said Anne-Marie, you know? Yeah, it's always Anne-Marie to me. Well. Yeah, it's always Annie. Yeah. I'm slower than molasses today, man. Dome. 
and the dog is barking. Chloe can't hear. She just took a shower, so her hear her hearing aids are off. Her hair is wet. So. <sighs> No, actually, a lot of people do. Well, I, I hear it, but yeah. Okay. I've heard it just on, like, YouTube and that kind of thing where people are, like, talk, referring to you or something. You know? Like, not obviously in person or, you know, but... I think that way that's what I'm talking about. And the dog keeps barking. Okay. What do we do? What can we do? And I keep bumping my camera. I do, I do, I do. I'm going to text Chloe. Sorry, she can't hear. So she'll have her phone in her hand. What's that? Oh, what did he say about that? I didn't even say anything about it. Here's my <laughs> Yeah, my hubby usually calls me when just I'm leaving for work. <laughs> it's like, yes, okay. I leave for work almost the same time every day. Mm, smoke almost like the yes. Almost the same time every day for the last five years. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, Chloe's texting me back. <laughs> uh, nice that does sound good. Uh, Kendra's braiding her hair. Hey, that's good. At least I'm not doing it. <laughs> her hair is so thick. I get wrist wrist pain <laughs> braiding her hair. Okay. I finally washed my um, mat. I had to hand wash it because I didn't want to lose it. And I didn't want to sit in the laundry forever. But I got the pretty hand washed, hand washed you what? Sorry. My, my mat, my cloth mat thingy here. Oh, that's okay. Yeah. I had that coffee stain in there. It was driving me nuts. Oh. <laughs> But I didn't want to misplace it because it's or it to get end up in my tea towel thing because it kind of looks like a tea towel or wherever because you know yeah. kids husbands all like where is it kids and husbands don't know where anything goes. Oh my goodness, the dog is barking. Which one? Which one? Oh, Loki Poke. But she just oh, went okay. now. I just don't like her to bark at all. I watched that video of um, Pippi attacking your finger, Anne Marie. <laughs> made me laugh when she when she jumped out from that tunnel cat tunnel she's like she's fierce man <laughs> she's 
pretty well fought up because you get because she knows you're not supposed to point fingers. <laughs> yeah. I'll get that. <laughs> Summary. I'm really, they've been called we. Ow, 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 ow. How do I get my hand out? Ow. Is it sharp? Is it? Staple. Ow. Oh, staple. <laughs> oh. That, that, that was a staple before, uh, <laughs> before tape. Before Anne Marie gave me, oh, that hurt. Now I got a staple. Oh, wow. yeah. Turning it, turning it, just like <laughs> stop. That kind of hurt. Now look at the bleeding. Ouch. Blood. Don't faint. Don't faint. <laughs> Don't faint. This is a trigger warning. <laughs> yeah. Injuries. We we have injuries. This this video contains violence and <laughs> yeah, blood. Yeah. Violence, <laughs> violence, and. Uh... <laughs> I mean, I took my cardboard fuel to work and everyone freaked out over it. Julie, you should watch her video on it. <laughs> the cardboard shield. <laughs> wow. Oh, that hurts. I'm whining over this now. Okay. Contains violence and scenes of a graphic nature. <laughs> Might be a two parter because I've got bricks. <laughs> oh, I've got bricks. Bricks. I was bricks. thinking bricks, but then I don't know. I just pulled out. Yeah. Not bricks. <laughs> That's because I didn't intend to uh, have a longer video because of um, I didn't mm. have to work early, but now I do have to work mm. early. So it's like, yeah. But the thought stayed with me. <laughs> yeah. I have to watch that video. Ouch. Ouch. I'm a big baby today. It's really gushing. <laughs> gushing, is it? Is gushing. It gushing? It's gushing. I, I know, thank you. I would swell up and be itchy and sore. No, thank you. Cat scratch, be crazy. <laughs> no. Did you get your new sofa, Amory? Because I don't think you've posted pictures of it. I don't remember seeing it. I looked out for it. <laughs> I'm a big whiny. I'm whiny. Yeah, big baby today. I'm about to, uh, I didn't stop. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. Maybe I'll just, just probably take that staple out too. Probably dry by now. Oh, I needed my coffee. Heat up. I don't even think I drank a sip out of it. Just the same, but smaller couch. Oh. Smaller is good. As long as you're not. If you can stretch, if you can like kind of chill on it. I know you like sleeping on your couch sometimes. All the time. I'd be able to on there. <laughs> huh? Yeah. All the time. Should I sleep <laughs> on the couch? Come on, get real. All the time. <laughs> well, <laughs> who doesn't? 
that's what, what I do in, <clears throat> when I get back for lunch from work. I usually end up just having a snooze on the couch. I don't like sleeping on the couch, but it is comfy. I had to sleep on it recently. <laughs> and it is comfy ish. Like it's so. Because there's some couches that kind of crouch you, crutch, uh, like you make you feel like you're like stuck. But yeah, you gotta have the right couch. God, it's gotta pass the sleep test. Now you go to bed. <laughs> yeah, we chose chose a massive one for our living room and that because we had lots of space. Mm -hmm. So you know, we just went big. Yeah, that's and, good. Uh, Can't. Mine's a little too big for the space, but I am not willing to switch the faux leather right now because of the pets. Oh, yeah. It's easy to clean. I'm not going back to silk. <laughs> the silk was a pain in the ass. Excuse my language. They're swearing now. Yeah, yeah. Violence and language. Wow, we really have to. We really have to. Um, what's that called? Do the thing. Timothy. Yeah, I used to have to use the half uh, peroxide, half water to clean it, wipe it with a fiber. That's how I had to clean it. I couldn't clean it with anything else. Silk. My old couch. I will not go back to that. With having pets? No. Nope. And I just have a faux leather couch that the pets can be used with their paws. Yeah. And I could just spray it and wipe it. Spray and walk away. <laughs> yeah. Spray, wipe the paw marks off and done for. You know, like spring was murder on my couch before. So. Wow. What's your couch? <laughs> <laughs> well, I was for a while there thinking get rid of the couch, but yeah, yeah I've got got one of those corner. It looks like a corner one. It's got an added footstool on the one side, and but the other side is uh, six and a half foot long. Yeah, and then uh, and probably six foot for the other side, and the, but you can make it longer with the um, with the stool. Yeah, oh, it's very nice. Biggest couch I've ever owned. <laughs> yeah, I um was contemplating not having a couch, but then I have no sitting room when the grandkids and that come over. And then I took my cot, my dining room table out because with COVID, I say another word I'm not allowed to use on on the internet. No one's allowed to come over, so we weren't dining for two, two almost three years. So may as well get rid of that. And then, you know, plants took over my life and now that kind of jazz. <laughs> so now I don't have a dining room, table, but I'm planning, I have a bar uh, type of kitchen thingy. So you can sit up in front of the, you know, while people, you know, you're in the kitchen. So like there's room for like us to sit there. So that's okay. Um, but planning the spring to make it in a smaller space because it's way too big and taking up so much room. So I'm going to try to rearrange my living room a bit, but I definitely like having a couch because at least then we can play our games, um, board games on the coffee table or whatever. I, you know, have to have a place to play games and do puzzles, even though my puzzle making was like, I'm thinking of putting a bigger top on my coffee table because I am so squished for room. I was figuring maybe I could just add one because I like the drawers on the coffee table I have. So if I just add a nice wood on top, somehow get that adhered on there. Yeah. Have a little more room for board games and just puzzling. Piece is fitting on there, but it's not like I could, you know, easy to find all the pieces and whatnot. 
helicopter. The other day, the planes sound, sounded like they were flying pretty low. You could hear them like, holy. Just humming. Yeah, they'd have to probably look for Novak Djokovic. <laughs> <laughs> After he got kicked out of Australia. Hmm. Sorry, I shouldn't be mean about that. <laughs> well, we already ruined the video, I swore. And I... <laughs> blood out here and so we're already yeah yeah <laughs> we're on the warning already <laughs> we're already yeah we can just say what we want now <laughs> just totally do that 10 49 where is my picture oh. Goodness gracious, I need to have a space for all the kids' crafts. I need to separate it from my junk. <sighs> Gotta be careful I don't cut myself with this thing again. very aware of time at the moment <laughs> i probably should have sanded it down this this one is way too shiny glossy I do not want to get myself again on the move, man. Let me see if I can get that staple out now. It should be. The glue should. <laughs> <laughs> My brain was not working then, all okay? right? Well, Humberies was, so we were okay. Yeah, I'm <laughs> luck there. All right. I am going to try to get that staple out because I keep putting my hand in there. It's the only way to hold it sometimes. The glue, the glue is working. We have a staple. I don't think I need my hand down that far, so that's good. It's all good. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness, what a mess of a mess here, man. Messy, messy, messy. Mm, what am I going to do? I'm scared to touch myself on uh, my pants or anything because my hands are got paint on them. I don't, I did put on my work clothes. <laughs> Silly me. If I ruin my clothes, I'm going to be going to work like a hobo because, like, yeah, I thought about getting into my workplace first, and then I thought, well, no. <laughs> yeah, I um, shouldn't have, but I did. I don't have too many. I've gained way too much weight, to, and I gave all my clothes away to the girls, right? Mm. So, and then I felt like also that I was getting too old Woo. for some of the things. We well, you know where styles just don't suit you anymore. Yeah. When you look like mutton dressed as lamb. <laughs> yeah. So. Yep. That feeling. Yeah. So I. I don't. Yeah. I didn't have clothes. And I'm just like. I was in denial forever that I. Didn't fit anything. <laughs> I know yeah. no, that feeling too. <laughs> yeah. I think. I'm like. I'm not huge. It's just that. I'm bigger than what I was. I don't think. You know. As. Just. Yeah, I actually eat food now, whereas before I didn't really eat much then, except for rice. <laughs> so I was like, eh, not very good. 
Not very good. Anna Marie, Anna Marie used to always give me crap. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm doing this for now. I am thinking I'm going to add a little bit more paint before if I decide to add more detail. I'm not sure. Yeah. I'm just shaping all my bricks into odd shapes. Now I started off symmetrical and then I thought, no, that's not right. <laughs> yeah. Let's true. take some of that symmetry out. <laughs> And I find clothing so ridiculously expensive. So I'm trying mm -hmm. to get everything, you know, what I can secondhand. Just brand new clothes is really ridiculous. Uh, uh, yeah, I was going to say, everything's just expensive at the moment, though, isn't it? Yeah. I just, like, I bought um, everything on sale that was, you know, Brand new these shirts for work. I had to buy a few because I was like I'm running out. And I managed to get them like 15 bucks or 11 or 10. You know, that's pretty darn cheap for compared to what they were asking for the ones that weren't too much different that were now in <laughs> on the not clearance rack. <laughs> $35 for a shirt or sweater that's thin. I'm like, what? I try to thrift all mine, but I um, a lot of the thrift stores are closed right now, so there's like oh, some of hi, hi Lucinda, sorry you popped yeah. in without a and I haven't looking down. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know it's like you're concentrating, you're missing a lot of yeah. it. Yeah, concentrating and trying to speed up because of work, <laughs> mm -hmm. and it's not working. Not working. Not quite sure what mine is yet, um, Rebecca. I keep wanting to say Rachel. <laughs> Rebecca. I know. Like I said, sometimes you just like your brain's like eh, wrong name. Here we go. Probably going to decide as I. Uh, I I do like to dress dress uniquely but my kids make fun of me so i'm like kind of not for work i kind of been slowing down on the, the real weird stuff that i do i'm just gonna use burnt umber i think <sighs> i am making a mess do -do. Should have gone. I, th I thought I'll get use the smaller size tube because it'll, I'll go quicker. <laughs> yeah. Hi, we we see uh, just just as well. I did look. I'll be at this forever. Well. So you can jump on the table. No, he's more interested in the containers that are in the closet. Okay. <laughs> Just sniffing at them. And he's like, yeah, mom's not kicking me out right now. Ha, ha, ha. No. 200, 2 o'clock, what? Eek? 2 what? Okay, I got to read that. Sorry. 200 things challenge. Oh, 200 Things Challenge. Is that 200 Things to Eat Challenge? <laughs> oh, we should that do good. that. We should do that. <laughs> oh, my gosh. We should do that. <laughs> we should do that and make a journal. Guys, we should do that. Try 200 new things and make a journal and see how long, if we can do it from the year. <laughs> Who's in? 
seriously, Julie, Rebecca, Amory, do a little, <laughs> just a little junk journal of it. Yes. And then we'll share it with everybody and get everybody in on it. No. <laughs> okay, just 200, just to do our best to try new, t new foods, 200 new things to try. It could be candy, it could be, and then we will put it in our junk journals and we could paint whatever it is we eat or draw it or have the wrapper or whatever. I got to write this down so I don't forget to. And there's no no rush in the date of it's got to be done. Let's just try to do it in a year. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I'll torture you, Julie. <laughs> have you done your 200 thing yet? Did you do it today? No, it doesn't have to be every day, right? And then we could just, that would be so fun. It could even be drink. So if you hadn't had, like, say, bubble tea ever or a flavor, that, that'll make it easier too, right? Yeah. 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 Okay. I got to write that down. I can't forget. Okay. Everybody's got to do that. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Do that. That's going to be fun. That'll be fun. <laughs> Amber, you in? 200 new new things, flavors. We can call it 200 flavors. Whatever you want to call it. We got to change the name a bit because if some, somebody made up 200 new things or something. Or 200 things. Was it 200 things? Kombucha. I've never tried that. No. I've never tried that either. I, maybe I have, actually. Now I have to ask my friend what she gave me. <laughs> she come from the library one day. She's like, here, try this. Okay. She makes ferments, things, and all that jazz all the time. She's always like telling me, try something. <laughs> oh, I'm going to be so happy. This is going to be fun. I, this will give me an excuse. I have to do it. Try more foods. Because I haven't been trying lots of things. And I usually do. In the past, anyways. Like, years ago. Yes, I've never eaten um, black pudding. Me neither. Okay, so 200 new Jeff things. Is too disgusting to me to eat. <laughs> it's like, no, thanks. I just use Lucinda, uh, Lucinda, yes. I just use Lucinda, sorry, buttermilk paint because I didn't have, I don't have gesso. Cat, what are you doing? Getting in my wool? Oh, there goes my wool. So I just put buttermilk on first and then I did the inside, the white parts with this acrylic more flat paint because the buttermilk's kind of shiny and I wanted it a little bit more white but with some of that yellow showing through so I did the white now I'm using raw umber for the wood so I did not do the regular type of because this has got a shiny coat on it it wasn't soaking hey come on Reese he's knocking paint on my feet Goes, uh, anyways, there goes that. He's just knocking things down. He ran away now. Yeah, I gotta get gesso. I don't have any. It's mostly that I get worried about when I need gesso for like things that soak up paint because I don't want things to soak up my paint. We could continue this project to next time near Nikki if, if you're not yeah, done. Yeah. Because yeah, I am sure. like far from even, I don't even have a window or anything in here built yet. Yeah, we're going to have to because I'm going to have to go in about half an hour. Yeah, and I don't have windows or anything in mine. So I'm just doing the first. Yeah, we're doing kind of like maybe a little <laughs> fairy housey thing, but a little something. Something. A little something, something. something. A little something, something. Castle Fairy House, yeah. So, should we call it 200 flavors, guys? 200 flavors. <laughs> could be anything. To, oh, yeah, it could be, couldn't it? Yeah. Just so that, even if it's something that, you know, you, you've never done before in your life. Yeah. But, I don't know. Jump out of an airplane. <laughs> 
Well, I was just thinking more like foods, things you taste, the tasting taste. thing, gum, chocolate types, teas. Mm -hmm. Flavors, junk journal. And you could do it on a page, single page or anything and just put it together later or whatever you want, by, you know. Yeah, next time someone, someone offers you something that you've never tasted before. <laughs> Try it out. Yes, know how yummy or yucky it was. And would you recommend it to, you know, anything you want? It'd be fun. I think it'll be fun to make us try new things. You don't really eat anything new, not even candy, new candies. Well, that's good because you can try it and then you say, oh my God, it was disgusting. <laughs> so easy. So sour. Yeah. So sour. And you, and know, you never you know. Candies, you never know. You might like some. You, you never know. Yeah, you might end up liking something that you just haven't tried because it sounded so disgusting. Sounds disgusting. Yeah, there's some things that just sound really gross. <laughs> yeah. Like black pudding. Yeah. See, that's probably one I'm going to have to try because I've mentioned it twice now. And that. <laughs> oh, cool. Julie's down. Yeah, let's do it. Oh. Um, I, maybe we'll post eventually I'll get to thinking about like posting something in the group just to remind everybody and um, yeah and I'm sure we all can kind of like keep ourselves um, reminded whatever the word I'm trying to think of yeah, it might take like forever to do something like that but it's uh, an ongoing oh, yeah, thing like, just take a whole year or whatever yeah let's like just do one either journal for it or like something that you have on the side that you haven't used yet a journal that you want to write and glue your packages to or your picture of what you ate or a drawing of what you ate tried tasted if you went to a restaurant you can have like whatever they have on the table to represent that restaurant throw that in there it'd be so cool restaurant <laughs> well, i know I, I i haven't been to a restaurant quite yeah. Much, but yeah what, what's they, the restaurant again <laughs> they do have them open here i just haven't gone yeah no they are open here too yeah i just haven't bothered to go i don't think i have gone have i i don't think so eh, but yeah you know yeah. Take out food, uh, take out packages. We could you, try a different flavor, Chinese or curry, uh, yeah. Or curry. Yeah, Chinese or curry. And then you, you can save your menu or your package of description or whatever if you if you want. I'm just making it like totally crazy. Yeah. It's food all really? yes carry it. It'd be fun. And Julie's an Epicurean. Mm-hmm. There we go. It looks like wood. Oh, wait, one, missed one, missed one. Yeah, I was like not quite reading everything out anymore because I'm trying to paint and look at the thing and yeah. <laughs> not paint my walls like I did right over here. <laughs> I don't go to restaurants all that often just because they're expensive and I'm cheap. But um, yeah. I did last weekend buy Chinese for everyone. It cost an arm and a leg, but I did. Gosh, yeah. I don't, I don't know, has food, pri have food prices really gone up where you are? Yeah. Yeah, so it's so expensive now. Mm -hmm. But for the most part, I just eat the veggies and the, you know, ground turkey. Been living off of that pretty good. <laughs> oh, I want to get pieces of wood that are sideways in there, maybe in some spots. Okay. 
I think I'm going to, while I have this all kind of here, I'm going to try. I still want to add windows and doors, but I'm doing this totally backwards where I'm not adding anything yet. There's no wrong way to do it. It's just a weird way to do it, maybe. Yeah, that looks like an old wattle and daub house. Yeah. I... I don't know. I still, like I said, I still gotta make the. I was hoping to make some steps to go in and the door windows. That'll have to be next week, I guess. Yep. I guess so. cottage like yep yeah, yeah. It reminds you the of Tudor England yeah Julie eating out is expensive yeah and you never know like the one reason why I don't like eating out is I don't like that they use like sunflower seed oil you know and they use margarine when they cook. Like I don't use those things and I know they use those things cause it's cheap. And so it bugs me. So for the most part, unless it's like, I don't necessarily like doing it very often just because of that reason. I'm not a health nut obviously, but um, I like eating real food, not plastic food. So, and I don't like certain oils. I like prefer olive oil or, you know, prefer olive oil. Someone, someone wrote something about a boss, but I can't, can't see it now. So, <laughs> don't I know do. That, was. that one's too. Yeah. Um, yeah. And Marie says she's cut, cut her a takeout. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just. Oh, I think I cut that one too short. Dang it, darn it, darn it. I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing here. Yeah, it is. And uh, like too, you just like don't know really who's cooking your food. I get it. Yeah, maybe I'm just a weirdo. I'm a weirdo. But, the, you know, right now it's just I'm a little bit more cautious. And I just like, eh, don't often like. I really don't like. I'll tell you what I made the other week was nachos. Yeah. I've never made, I've never made nachos before. <laughs> like, you know, with the sour cream and the cheese. And yeah. Like, so oh, good. my goodness. I've never done it before. No? So like, never, never eaten it before, never done it before. Oh, wow. There you go. <laughs> you draw a pink nachos. <laughs> nachos, it's like, you know. Yay. <laughs> Had some mints and I was just fed up you know because it's like what do you do with mints <laughs> yeah needed it needed using up so it'd been in the freezer a while yeah oh nachos is something that happens often in our house like at least once a month you know where we make our nachos <laughs> so it's um yeah <laughs> okay enjoy your dinner 
so yeah i love uh, we yeah. like nachos. It's, it's got all the just uh yeah it's good and wings we like wings here too so we try to do that as often as we can probably around once a month for sure too so Try to. Yeah, it's like I've never eaten octopus and never eaten squid. Oh, <laughs> no, 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 no. Texture, texture, texture. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I... See, if it's like a thing, it's, uh, you know, maybe if you have the opportunity to try something. Yeah. I will yeah. not try that. I just don't like texture. Anything like that scares me. It's just yeah. a texture thing that is Bye, Anne Marie. Catch you later. <laughs> yeah. Big baby here for that. Big baby. <laughs> I am a big baby. I cannot do octopus. Anything chewy. Shrimp. I stopped eating shrimp. It's too chewy. Some, you know, it's like, nope. It's just bad childhood memories, I think, you know, just like, no, this things that, you know, like just traumatize. It just gives me that, that fear, <laughs> that fear comes to me and I'm like, nope, don't like that feeling, not eating it. <laughs> you know, it's not silly, but that's the way it is. It's like, can't breathe, can't breathe. My parents did torture me with liver. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I love liver. <laughs> I love it. I, I really do. Okay. And another thing that they tortured me with, donuts in a bowl of milk. Gross me out. Ooh. I will not go. I, I miss Tinkertown for that. I was like, nope, I was not allowed to go to Tinkertown. And that's like a little rye, kitty ride place. Nope. And they wouldn't, and they fed me it for a whole week just to pin, discipline me. Oh, so Donut, it, donuts in milk. Yes, gross, gross, oh, yeah. gross. It, it's probably any bread and milk, but gross, 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 with sugar in it. If you did bread, uh, it's slimy. It's it's gross and. Uh, Thank God. I've never, even I've never even heard of that before. Yeah. Doesn't sound like that. That's what you eat when you're poor because that's what obviously they ate a lot of when they were kids and they decided to torture us. Um, <laughs> forget it. I'm going to I'm going to rinse your mouth out with donut and milk. Gross. <laughs> Don't you give me any back chat, girl. <laughs> well, they were getting lazy about the milk. And the last couple of times, they made me eat the donut. And they thought it was maybe this the donut. They weren't very, I don't know. But it was, this, it was a combination. Of, it's just slimy anything in milk. I don't like milk. And I can't even, even if I, I you know how, like, I'm lactose tolerant. So I can't eat, drink it. Or anything but even if they had anything like that was like milk like almond milk and all that jazz ugh, just don't like all right, if i had to eat cereal i'd eat it with water yeah. I'm, fine. <laughs> I'm fine with that <sighs> that sounds disgusting <laughs> it's oh, yeah. it's not it's not so, so, Judy's, Judy's I tried so one good. time I tried one time cereal and apple ju juice just because I saw someone on TV or something do it and I'm like that oh, was yeah. disgusting that was gross that was that was really gross okay this is my theme Judy so far <sighs> but um
why my parents tortured me that way. I don't know. Anyway, so yeah. Liver's a, a no no for me. It's just, it tastes like freaking pennies, man. Liver. It's nice. It tastes like pennies. Despicable. Uh, despicable me. <laughs> oh, yep. Hey. Love you. Right, we got 10 minutes. You, 10 minutes before I have to go. You almost ready? Are you, are you waiting for her to pick you up? Okay. Ready for walk. Okay. You just realized what? What? Did, what? 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 Okay. Now. I got design. What kind of windows do I want? I want to do the arch ones, right? Draw. Uh, you've got to, no, you got to do stained glass ones now. Stained glass. Yeah. What era am I doing? Sorry, you you, you built a, a wattle and daub house, you know, black and white old Tudor house. So uh, sorry, <laughs> you've got to go with lead lines, lead lined windows. Okay. That's right, isn't it, girls? <laughs> and I'm going to have to have some arch doorways. I'm going to do an archy doorway here. My phone is driving me nuts. Is that very centered? Not really. So um, I'll have to look up what you're saying that I'm building. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We well, have the opportunity now because uh, we're going to have to uh, go. Yeah. Oh, this is only... Hmm. Hmm. Okay, I'll do this side. Oops, not doing this. Mm -hmm. This is not very archy. It's very pointy. I don't know. Maybe I'll do it less pointy. I'll make that my last oh no I'll go across there and then that'll be the last time to go then okay I'm just sketching out where I might want my doors and I gotta do windows right do I do round windows this yeah. is no Not that I need to erase, but I'm going to know what my lines are. Oh, boy. i got to also make a roof. Yep. Roof. <laughs> roof. Yeah, that white milk and clear glass. Hmm. It is different. I just don't like milk. Even looking at milk is gross. But, I mean, I cook with it, but I do. What am I looking for? What am I building, Nikki? 
you know, you, you either go in Tudor or um, look for Wattle and Daub House or Tudor, Tudor House, Black and White House. One of those. Okay. Oh, my my video is clinking off. Oh yeah, it is time to go then. <laughs> Yeah, you are, you are, um, stuck, frozen. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Not now, though. No. I think you were. But I was only glancing up and down. <laughs> There goes my camera again. Right. I think we've come to that natural stop now, and we just yeah. my uh, stop. My line and uh, what I'll do is um, off camera is just finish the bricks all the way up, so that when we come back, I'm ready for painting all the roof. <laughs> okay. So you know, because everybody's seen. How I'm doing the bricks. Oh. Well, there we go. That's us for today. It's been almost two hours, so there you go. <laughs> oh, fried chicken livers. Fried chicken liver, yeah. Uh, well, okay, yeah, guys. Right. Sorry. <laughs> I suppose that's okay because I like pate, so. Mm. So that would be okay. I know pate doesn't taste bad though. I had to pate. <laughs> it doesn't taste like liver. Yeah. Nice hanging out with you too, Rebecca. Yes. Thanks for joining in with us. Yes, thanks for joining us, Lucinda. And I know I know yeah. for making dinner. Let us know if you try and think new. <laughs> yeah. So don't forget two thousand uh two thousand two hundred uh <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you. 200 flavors. <laughs> yeah. well, thanks, for, yeah, thanks for watching, everyone. See you all again very soon. Hi, Yvette. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Thanks for watching. You too. Have a good day, everyone.